can just spring up and just have beautiful carpets. And so I did some of the very south end of Salt Spring where a lot of those old buildings, those original settlers buildings, many of them are well over 100 years old, and for us that's old, um, and the daffodils are still propagating and just in lawns and fields and around some of the wonderful old heritage houses. So this one here is in the Burgoyne area, so down at the bottom of uh, Lee's Hill. And I just love the old homestead, the beautiful little Burgoyne United Church, but the daffodils just really called to me. And this one here is Maxwell Hill, and um, this is Mount Maxwell, the beautiful Burgoyne United Church. I did it with the daffodils because this is just, spring is just a very beautiful time on the island. And uh, of course, everybody's doing their plantings in the background. There's orchards of olives and vineyards as well. But off Venice and I uh, went to witness a lot of the glass blowing and I ended up buying one of these beautiful vases and I loved it because they had they have these bubbles of, of um, colors and infused gold and as you know I use a lot of gold in my paintings well I use this vase daily at home and uh, this particular time I had it stuffed with daffodils and it just really brought to life all the little fused gold in the vase and the daffodils just meandering and draping and falling so